hopefully the Olympics would inspire more people to pick up a racket and play. Um, I know when, when I go home, uh, I play with my, my little brother seven and we just go out and play in the garden. And it's, it is so easy to play, you know, you can do it in the park. You, there's loads of courts available everywhere. And yeah, I think if one thing does come out of the Olympics, I'd love it to be that more people picked up a racket and had a go. Yeah, when I first started out, actually I joined the same club as my brother. So I used to play a little bit with my brother. He claims he stopped while he was still beating me, but I'm not, I'm not sure if that's true or not. Um, and then my parents, they both played socially as well. So yeah, when I was younger, um, we'd always go and have a little hit. And actually at Christmas, I did take them back to where it all started and gave them a little run around, which they did. I don't know if they enjoyed it that much, actually. <laughs> a bit worn out. One of the great things about the Olympics, it's such a good shop window for our sport. Um, so many people see it. Always at the Olympics, always people like, oh God, I can't believe badminton's that quick and that exciting. So it's great that, that we have that opportunity. Obviously, if we can do well, um, it, it obviously helps. But um, yeah, if we can inspire anybody you know, to pick up a racket and to go out in the garden or have a hit. That's where I started. I started in the grand, uh, with my granddad in the back garden and so yeah, um, always our aim and um, working closely with sponsors, we also go and try and do demonstration days. As I said, we, we want to get the youngsters playing and, and help the sport grow.